other concern was so much sand was building up on the roadway as well because of the winds that we talked about yesterday and it's all due to, yes, this storm that continues to try to edge into the Coachella Valley. Ryan capturing those clouds ushering over the mountains. It's called the rain shadow effect, but the reason it doesn't bring any moisture into our neck of the woods is because of this pressure built out by strong wind. Right now, current wind speeds, it looks like the heaftiest wind is right along the I-10. We've got 13 to 20 mile an hour winds in Indio, 17 mile an hour winds in Cathedral City. So far, strongest wind in Palm Springs, 28 miles an hour, and we're just getting into the thick of it. Remember, as the sun goes down, that pressure tightens up, and natural response here in a natural wind tunnel, a lot of wind. The wind is also a response to moisture getting closer. We're not completely done with this moisture element. I mentioned we wouldn't be until Wednesday morning after the wind keeps all this moisture at bay. So tonight still doesn't look like rain's going to make it over the mountains. Instead, wind is the big weather story and we do have a weather advisory posted for our local mountains. Details can't miss. Coming up, my complete forecast, Janet.